Okay, I'll need this. I thought. Either I. I don't know what happened there. Either the stream didn't stop when I thought it did, uh, which means I might have to just cut out a bit of the recording, or it started recording again because I pressed the button again, or I pressed because I pressed it twice for it to shut it off. But either way, uh. Ahoy again, everyone who may be watching now or later. Uh, I'll be your Captain Hillian uh, today, along with... The fearsome first mate Drakir at your service. And welcome to the next game we'll be streaming, which is, well, Rayman Origins. Now, uh, let's see. Uh, yeah, autosave. Now, are you going... Why are you not responding to the controller? Let's see. Huh. Oh yeah! Now I... What did it dawn on me now that... Ain't this basically the first multiplayer game? Of Rayman? Uh, seconds, actually. There was another Rayman game called Rayman M or Rayman Arena, depending on where you were. Uh, because ah. uh, yeah, apparently people thought Rayman M might stand for Rayman Mature, even though it still stood for Rayman Multiplayer or something like that. Uh, which, well, as the name supply, uh, suggests, an it's an if arena brawler in 3D, and uh, from what I heard, it uh, from what I've heard, it was quite good. Uh, but especially the music, because each er e <clears throat> each arena had different music for each character, and there were like eight characters or something, maybe even more than that. Okay. Now, why the hell is it not responding to the controller, though? Hmm. L let me look. Let me give it a quick look. Uh, uh, it's going to flashbang. Uh, not, so let me... not too bad. It was yeah. only white screen on half the screen. Uh, let's see. Xbox controller. Why is it... Hey. I just realized, we got a new follower. Uh, yeah, uh, Lance2185, thank you for following. That is actually someone I know from uh, another game that I've played. I I, <clears throat> I started up that up again today. Uh, well, actually, I started up a few days ago, but I, I, start, I went on to it you know, today to take a look around for people I knew, and, well, they were on, so we chatted up a bit, and the fact that I'm streaming, you know, that I stream, uh, <clears throat> came up, and, well, they decided to send the follow. So, yeah. Yeah, thanks again for that. Oh, how nice. Uh, let's see. Is there anything? Raymond Origins FAQs. Let's see. Controller. Control F. Let's see. How do I use an Xbox 360? Uh, it should have these. What the hell is this? Hmm. Okay, does Raymond Origins support newer controllers? Also, I should I should start the bloody counter. Let's see. Da -da -da. Xbox PC controller. It is. Let's turn it on. It worked. Okay. Try checking the controller profiles via Steam. Wait, could it be that the? Let me check this. Well, Steam did have an update recently. Uh, this I this should have been done uh, put in long ago and uh, let's see Rayman Origins does does it not allow controllers at all or something? Let's see full full controller supports the hell. Then why is it not responding to it? Hmm. Or maybe maybe it's not responding to it in the menus or something. Okay. Well. If it doesn't want to work with the controllers, then we'll just have to go with keyboards. And let's start a new game. And start the timer here. And the uh, arrow?
Nice try. The heck? Try <laughs> its remains. <laughs> okay, it's not. Yeah, it's not responding to the controller at all. I'll look into that more later. But uh, yeah, <laughs> that's basically the story for this game. Uh, Rayman and the gang pissed off the grannies on downstairs, and uh, yeah, <laughs> in retaliation they decided to well fuck the entire upper world then. Holy, that is new. There we go. <laughs> yeah, we're going to have to find the lag tunes. And uh, should we be reading? The text, or is it moving too fast for you? Yeah, it's more. I don't want to go over Murphy's uh, babbling. Uh oh. Uh, anyways, we can move around at the moment with the arrow keys. Up doesn't do it. Well, it, it does this, but this is only useful in multiplayer because you can make yourself a platform for other players. And yeah, we can run with shift, jump with space. So, uh, yeah, let's go looking around. This here is... Well, this will explain it. Just by snoring on the job. Top guy uh, swinging the side over there guards the way into the land of the livid dead. He's a vain old fellow, you know. It, it, Get him some of the, get him some shiny new skull uh, teeth like this one, and he may let you into the dark realms. So yeah, that is how we get to the end game <laughs> by collecting those skull teeth. But how we get those, we'll find, we'll, well, we'll cover in a bit. For now, we can just get the hell out of here and get back to the glade of the back to the glade of dreams. A snoring uh, tree. Yep. And let's go to the gibberish jungle. Just pressing enter instead of space. I, I, actually, let me check something. I, I think the audio on the last few streams for the games was a bit low. So let me up this by five decibels again. It, I think we lowered it. Because it was really loud at one point recently with Shantae. Yeah, uh, we, we, we should have, that. Yeah, we should have turned that back. So yeah, hopefully it'll be more audible from here out, or better audible. Hmm. And uh, yeah, let's get started on It's a Jungle out there. And I'll remove the mouse. Yeah, and we are recording, all right. Yep, stop streaming, stop recording, stop replay buffer. I really should use the replay buffer more when... Uh, this funny stuff happens. Uh, holy! Those are some nice structures! <laughs> and yeah, one of the main features of this game is just how freaking beautiful it looks, but also, as shown there, you die in one hit. Yeah, if you already tried to capture a little bit of original Rayman, what the heck is that damn thing? No clue, actually. But, but yeah, there are there are elements from the original Rayman out in here, like that hat that was talking to it. That was actually that uh, was the hat of the. My uh, dad. That hat was the original of. Uh, from the original uh, game with the magician. And yeah, like in the original Rayman, we also have to unlock a bunch of abilities because we can't hover. And we couldn't hey, attack uh until just now. Oh dear, breaking his teeth. And also, 
I did not expect this to be really the start, considering from the trailer I saw. <laughs> yeah, the, the, as usual, trailers put it on a bit thick with uh, things that happen. Yeah, uh, I, yeah. I, I, I should probably explain. They were doing a bit of an eggplant joke, though they weren't sure what he was. And of course, when he uh, is summoned, the first thing he does is throw his helicopter hair under Very one of skirts. the Nim skirts. Uh, and uh, also making a return from the first game, <laughs> these hunter characters. Wait, I wonder where mushrooms. Nope. Uh, also, that heart that's been following us, that is an extra hit. You can have only one at a time, though, I believe. And if, if we hit certain plants like that, it'll well, do things. And we can pop and play the enemies for extra lumps. Yay! And environmental effects will just as easily hit. Nope. What the heck is with the hunters? Do they have an allergy or something? Uh, an allergy to pain, I think. Also, we messed it up earlier, but if we get one of these ping lungs... First off, we get a bunch of lungs from them. But it also means we get double lungs from all the other ones that we collect. Uh, wait. Was he about to throw a stick at you, like a spear? Yep. Uh, these skull coins, you, once you collect them, well, once you touch them, you don't collect them yet. You need to get a certain distance or a certain time with them without getting hit before you can collect them. Well, before you get the lumps from them. Oops. And yeah, that, that accidentally what showed the... the one hit. What the heck? There we go. And uh, let's get, let's actually hit the thing. Let's get our first batch of electives. What uh, the this, heck? This game is silly as all hell. Obvious, it counts up the amount of lumps we get along the way, and we get rewards for that, like Electunes. Uh, though I don't exactly know what the medal or something does, other than the, maybe Dragon Rides. Also, you can stop in the middle of these loading screens, and if there were other people, you could smack each other around. <laughs> okay. Moving on to the next place. Geyser Blowout. <laughs> oh, there's the magi magician's hats. There's lazy, la yeah, those ye ugh, lazy yellow fellas are lums packed with energy. Uh, lumps can be quite illuminating for those who know how to use their energy, and they, it is a bit, it is partially gibberish, but there are some words in there that sort of line up with English, like uh, the fairy it, I, or nymph said I, something similar to attack, and I well, think it is energy. It, it might be French. It says there are many borrowers in English from French. Now, I don't think it is French. And skull coins. Okay, maybe not French, but that sounded trying to sound Australian. Yeah, that, that sounded like he's actually said twenty-five there. So it, it is just it is a mixture a gibberish of ten languages, I'm guessing. Yeah. So it, it could very well be French or something. 
No, it, it's not. It's definitely not French. I I know a bit of French, and I know it, that wasn't it from what I could tell, at least. Yeah, I should probably remind people this game was made in France at first, so. Give me the hearts. Do we expect a bit different humor? Come on. Uh, yeah, we're going to have to deal with these geysers a lot, I'm guessing. Yeah. Uh, but what I mean, humor is. Uh, you. Some would assume this is a kid's game, but there's a lot of. Mature jokes. Yeah, or rather immature. Yeah, that too. Okay, we can punch those for extra lumps. And here we go. I feel that's a reference to a Disney movie or something. Yeah, we missed that one. Some uh, things in the bubbles will generally just try to float off screen. Back, come on. And uh, yeah, these things, it's clearly obvious what they do. Uh, what the heck is that statue? Carry. Go. And. Okay. Get things moving again. Yep, yep. We missed that. We can Yeah, we can still go back, but. Oh, yep. Okay, it's still there. But we missed it all the same. Okay, did it, I, I thought the moment that you moved on to the next screen that things in this game would. Well, the old things would get deleted. But apparently not. Okay. Nothing to get squashed. And is that yes, there is something hidden up here. Uh, that face. Yep, shift the sprint. And we get pretty hairy to get through some of these parts. Okay. Now, if I remember correctly, if we. If we try to bounce off of those things with a yep, with a ground pound, we actually get more distance from it, or more height to be specific. Okay. Oh, and these, yeah, those things, yeah, they will try to grab you, so you do not want that to happen. Uh, if it does want to grab you, don't if he want to eat you. Okay. My geyser. There we go. It, That's a good match. It, is there lumps to one singing? Yep. I yes. hate it. <laughs> You'll hear plenty of it then. Oh dear. I, I know I know the, the, what they're doing. And I, ever since I heard Disney movies do that, even as a kid, I hated it. If we already have a heart, we get we just get some extra lungs from that. Okay. Just got to deal with these. Come on. It is a bit annoying to go from one Rayman game where you can hover to one where you can't. So, there we go. And yeah, we have we do have to kill those things because they are sh shielding. Are we, are we going to get a bit stuck here? There we go. They are shielding the cages. And it seems we missed few, a few cages here. Hmm. Let's see how much is the maximum. Okay, three fifty. But we still got enough for the two other lectins. gets a bit too excited about how many lumps we get. Yeah, we concern only much. Yeah. So one difference between this game yeah, another difference really is that 
New character unlocked in the snoring tree. Uh, in, the, in the original Rayman game, the magician was also a uh, Rayman-like character. Let's see. Okay. Who have we unlocked then? Okay, we have we have unlocked Blue Rayman. <laughs> and now he's ready for the Blue Man group. Oh no! Uh, but yeah, as we as we collect elect tunes, we will also unlock other skins. But we will have these four always by default. So, shall we go as a <laughs> Blue Man, a Glowbox, or one of the Teensies? I say Ray Lou Raymer for now, and what's with him? The green one, what's the heck is with him? Uh, yeah, he's kind of gone a bit mad, but uh, I believe it's in the I believe it's in the manual or something, but I believe that he's supposed to be the one dreaming up all of this stuff. Okay. Punching Wait, you mean the uh, I meant the teensy in the bubble going nuts. <laughs> Uh, no, not that. No. <clears throat> Should we have a not? Wait, he's the is he the new? Oh, bloody! What was his name? Polocus. Hmm? Polocus, yes, Polocus. I think he might be. Uh, let's see. Beautiful Mula of the Glade. Getting the bubble lumps until they're empty. Good, yeah, like you said, we can bind up our attacks as well. Which will play these things out immediately. Not forget those. Uh, shoddy craftsmanship like this, we can break. Okay. Yeah, things are going to be a look. The heck? Oh. Uh, still, what the heck? What the heck uh, indeed? He's so grateful he's acting as a living platform. Oop. Miss, miss. Okay, that one's not flying away, it seems. Or slowly flying away. Uh, yeah, it, it's going to take me a bit of time to get used to uh, controlling this with the with keyboard. <laughs> what the heck, alien? Uh, just drop, dropping him as he was not nothing. Well, he didn't seem to care about it either. Uh, but yeah, you, you've probably noticed as well, whenever we hit one of those red bulbs... Oh, we do not want to hit that. Whenever we hit one of those red bulbs, it starts the environment moving. Okay. Okay, and do things. Oh, shortcut. Okay. Kill me. <laughs> oh, there, there's something over there behind the grass. <clears throat> okay, let's see what it is. Oh. Okay, bit of a challenge area then. And uh, yeah, the hunters will just be fermenting lumps if you leave them alone. Okay. Bye bye, you, and hello, Electunes. We definitely missed a bunch in the last one. 
Now, let's just keep moving on. I don't think there is an... I think the only requirement for finishing the game is to get the red you know, the uh, red skull teeth for uh, you know, getting into the land of the living dead land of the living dead okay Did you notice those would vanish could vanish ow okay. that uh, yeah we're not we're not playing for high scores we're just playing for the fun of it yeah. Like, we try, we try to get a true ending location if it's doable and not mind wrecking, so to speak. Yep. You. But then again, yeah, true endings is a story ending. I, I, I don't think in many games high score matters for an ending. Yep. Um, yeah, beyond opening up new areas, the electrons are mostly for <coughs> sk for skins and such. But we will still be getting as many as we can. We won't go entirely out of our way to get ones that are frustrating to get. Yeah. Again, we're playing to have fun, not to get frustrated. Yeah. <laughs> Too if much. We to, if we wanted to. Uh, Torture ourselves, we'd go play, we'd go play, you know, Dark Souls. Oh dear. Ooh. Ooh, that's going to be a bit of a tricky one. Okay, we do get a moment of invulnerability if we get hit, like you saw there. But we still lost our extra heart. Give me that. Uh, that's kind of rare nowadays. You know, rare to extreme. Like, it, it's a common thing in older games, but mm. in the world, what was it? What is it called? That uh, moment you're frames? temporarily invisible. Uh, uh, sorry. In invincibility frames. Yeah, invincibility frames. You feel like they is an almost extinct thing. And maybe. You, though in old games, it was kind of needed. Yeah, and, well, it's, even in some older games, you didn't and even get invincibility frames. Yeah. You. And yeah, we we skipped through a bit there, but oh well. I think we have plenty of lums already for whatever electrons we can still collect yeah. from the end. But yeah, to, to preserve your sanity, I'll try to avoid the king lums. Oh, okay, we need a 300. Uh, it's fine, you, you butcher them. I just had to endure them. Okay. Mm. Yeah, if, if my memory serves me correctly, this game isn't too hard with uh, the elect tunes, but we'll find out as we get it later on. Okay. A new character, but we know who that is. That's Red Gl Glowbox. So, shall we swap to him, or shall we just keep going? Let us keep going. Yeah. We I'll could probably try them later. Okay. It doesn't make any physical difference, of course, it's just appearances. And, yeah. You... Okay. Uh, hmm? I just moved the cursor onto the game, but it actually shows up behind it, so it doesn't actually show up on the screen now. That's neat. But, yeah, if, if we finish a game with an extra heart, we keep it after, as you can see. Nice! Okay, give me a moment for a drink. The magician again. Something I've already explained. 
Okay, once he does that, he's out. Excuse me, does the puzzle sound almost Australian? I can't really say it. It, it sounds it sounds just silly to me. Yeah, it does not say just. It can't be sound like they hear an Australian accent coming out, but it's kind of hard to know. With the yeah, we'll, we'll uh, Raymanian accent for now. Uh, I guess that's probably the easiest. Uh, yeah, these skull coins can be in quite the tricky locations at times. This out and moving on. Hmm. Thought I'd miss those for a moment. And if I can wonder what's with the hunters? Yeah, they're poachers, basically. There you go. Yeah, the, the platforming is going to get more complicated as we get deeper into the game. I forget specifically how many levels there are, but there is a good amount. Okay, those almost got the drop on me. Late. Um, Up you go! See if it would hit that high, but no. And yeah, as is also probably clear, to get rid of the you know, to get rid of the red plants, just hit the blue bulb that they're growing from. Come on, hit it. There we go. Uh, yeah, they are generally rather slow, but if you st if you stand still in front of them long enough, or if you just run into them, you will get hurt. But they don't seem that threatening at the moment. Yeah, they're more they're more obstacles than enemies. There's a coin there, but yeah, we don't really need it. Oh, hello. <laughs> okay, he looks like he'd have a prickly uh, personality. <laughs> oh, hello. Yep, always keep an eye out for little passages like that. Uh, no plans to just knock all of them down at once, okay. It is taking some getting used to uh, with the controller. Without the controller. No, and we've missed another area. Okay. Go, and there, and there. Actually. What what even happened there for a moment? Good question. Uh, can we get that one? And yeah, it looks like we're forced to get this one, so prepare your ears. <laughs> that one sounded oddly familiar. I think that one was a reference to something. Yeah, it's always the same song. Oop, almost got caught there. And it was blocked, so this way then. Oh, 
What's like poking the eyes on the lums? Yeah, uh, because they're just a bunch of bastards. So mean. But yeah, you can get about six lums in every level. One of them, uh, one of them is always at the end. Two of them are dependent on your lum count. Uh, three in hidden cages, and the middle one is a time trial, I presume. Hmm. I don't know how to start or that. Or I presume that starts with uh, if you activate something. Hmm. Okay. I just clicked away there for a second on the chatty program because for some reason it's highlight it's highlighting names. Uh, Hmm. Yeah. Okay, it has a counter on the side, at least. Hmm. Yeah, may maybe that's maybe that just starts on a second runs and such. And uh, there's the nymph. Okay, What's he doing? Yes, he's holding but, something back. Yeah. But says, what is he holding back? Some free lungs. <laughs> Completely with that. Okay, let's see. Grab you. And grab some of those. Is there something hidden down here? There's a skull coin <laughs> and death. Oh dear. Yeah, the ground pounds do have a bit of an area of attack reach. Okay, looks like we get a lum for just picking them in the first place. And then popping them after. Okay. Take three. Yep. Eleven. Well, yeah, we get two lumps from each of them if we fully finish them off. Oh. Goes to the dynamite. Uh, wait. No, dynamites don't go poof. Nope. They go boom. <laughs> Well, it does go poof, but with a bit more <laughs> effect. Yeah. Uh, okay. Anything? Yep, there is another door. Okay. <laughs> is this an Angry Birds reference? Sure. Anyways, <laughs> eat like June's gone. <sighs> this just game is just so silly. Did but still. Nope, oh, didn't see him. Really beautifully made. Yeah, I'm pretty sure every. I'm pretty sure every inch of this game you know, that would have squished us has been hand drawn. They're very That's just impressive. Open. They probably still use some templates here and there, but even then, there's a bunch of a lot of effort put into those. Oh yeah. See here and here. I keep saying that I try to avoid them, but some of them are hard to dodge. Yep. Okay, good thing this one was here. That, that would have been instant death. Yeah! What the heck? Okay. 
Oh, and another one. Okay. Let's, do, let's not. I did not intend to go all the way back down, but okay. Did you just have a getting over at the moment? Uh, almost, I guess. If I don't people that don't know what get doing over it, it's a game that's... Uh, it's a rage game. Yeah. Basically what? made to make you angry. Okay. Uh, there is a little gap up there, but it doesn't seem like you can get through it. Hello? Really using it as a, a ball. It is a it is a ball. I don't know, there is a story here, right? Uh, sort of, yeah. Mostly our job is is to free the nymphs and the electums, and uh, well, you'll see what is waiting for us. Oh dear. Also, shall we keep going with this, or shall we just we can just skip them? I believe. Uh, I don't mind. <laughs> Apparently, uh, they can't be skipped, or at least none of the, none of the buttons that I pressed do it. Uh, he was a little, a little briefer. Yeah. New character. And she seems happy to see us. Yeah, we have enough electoons to reach the next world. Over the rainbow. So, but first, let's take a look at who we unlocked. We have Red Glowbox and we have <laughs> Rayman's biggest fan. Oh, kind of cute. Uh, what the heck is it with that last one? Uh, that must be Glowbox's biggest fan. <laughs> and I feel sorry for the guy. Okay, back out. Yeah, there's a there's a good few more skins to unlock. Then we'll see those in time. Hocus <laughs> Polocus, really? Actually, do you have what other lines do you have? <laughs> Single enough. Okay, that's enough. Let's go over the rainbow. Yeah, do you realize you switched the character? <laughs> uh, okay, here we go. Oop. Okay, that's a big ass <laughs> that tune. Uh, but, but seriously, do you want me to dodge these ones to have not have them singing? Uh, I, I can't handle the singing. I don't like them, but it's not enough to make me crazy, at least. Yeah. Unless you start spamming them. Okay, more of those guys. Oh, hello. Purple ones. Yeah, what did you say again about spamming them? <laughs> because the game certainly seems to be. Yeah, that 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 just felt like the game decided to punch me. <sighs> uh, oh wait, that looks horrifying. <laughs> okay. No, we get all of the, we get all of them here at least. And yes, it does that little fanfare when you get all of the electrons in a place. Hmm. Oh, and 
Over the rainbow. Yeah, that's a reference. Hmm. Okay, a bit odd that it did. Yeah, of course. That's for getting all of the lumps in the entire level. Right. Hee ho, mosquito. <laughs> okay. Oh, I think I remember these levels. Should we be concerned? Uh, maybe. Is that all you're saying? <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, this looks familiar, I presume. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we get to do a side scrolling shoot him up bit. What the heck? I believe there are a few of these throughout the game, but not too many. Is that one? That. Oh, Have I see fine. mosquito favoritism? <laughs> uh, these are more flies than uh, mosquitoes that we're shooting. No, I meant they want to be riding. Uh, and what, what did you say about the mosquito favoritism or something? Uh, yeah, mosquito favoritism, like, usually... Let's be honest, do this almost everyone hates mosquitoes. Really? No, for some, re for some reason they seem to bite me less. Thank you. Same. And, uh, yeah, some places are going to have piranha waters, so you gotta keep an eye on that. Okay, speaking of keeping an eye on things, something hit me, and I completely missed what. Yeah, is this the coach just upgraded the helmets or hats? Yep, those we can't jump on. That. But yeah, if you expect this game to have even one single non-silly bone in, it, in its body, <laughs> then you're going to be disappointed. Like, <laughs> it's playing music on a freaking kazoo. What the heck? <laughs> oh, those are seeking. That one off, so let's just deal with this one. But yeah, th these these little bits aren't just for fun, they're actually moving us from one world to the next. As you can start seeing in the background now. Yeah! We're... Okay, that's a new. Oh, hello. What the heck? Uh, we found our angry birds. Uh, was angry bird a thing back then? Oh, damn it. I think it'd been, uh, it'd been a thing for a bit already. Yeah, I knew so little about Angry Bird that I barely paid mind to it when it became a thing. Yeah, I, I've never cared for it myself really either. But yeah, there we have it. Yeah, right, <laughs> we can move uh, on. I was expecting something to happen. Yeah, same! Uh, but uh, yeah. The first world done, and doing a little dance. Uh, of course, if there were other players, they'd be filling in the other 
<laughs> the other plot in his plate. Yeah. The other uh, place in the photo yeah. shoot thing, though you can get up to four players, I'm, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it did say show. It did show four players thingy earlier when you were shaking the controls. True. So, yeah. as if I almost was expecting to change the signboard now and then. Hmm. But, guess they just gonna reuse the same one? Yeah. Okay, there is one mission here that we couldn't do yet because we didn't have enough electunes, as you can see in the little bar. It also shows you well, where we're missing lums, missing electunes still. Okay. okay. Desert of didgeridoos. So uh, you were talking about Australian accents. Now, <laughs> now we're going to the most Australian world ever. Oh dear. Crazy bouncing. Hmm. I don't remember how long this game is, but I think we'll still be busy with it for a few streams at least. Stop it! <laughs> We've had <laughs> nothing but silliness. You mean the one with you, that we already have? Okay. Which is good because you you can just smack your friends around and end up messing everything up. No. Okay. And there we go. Here. Yeah. Okay. Playing multiplayer as a younger on the same couch as friends that was fun, but some games were almost impossible to play together with friends due to always someone started to fight each other on these kinds of games. Uh, yeah, which is off to be expected. Okay, there is a coin up there, but we can't really get it at the moment. Yeah, I think the hardest one was probably Battletoads due to when you were even when you tried both try to see to play it, you could always uh, even accidentally hit each other in that game. And then again, but the Toad is infamous for being hard. Yeah. Okay. We have new enemies. We have new sources of lums, and we have new obstacles. And as you can expect, getting hit by that would be not fun. So on we go. Oh. More Angry Birds? Yep. Okay. Oh, okay. Let's wait for that to go up. And there we go. I believe this world is very light due to the music. Interesting aesthetic, too. And there is... There is a bunch... There are a bunch of Electoons. There we go. You can hear them crying for help, to help find them. Wait, you see through the birds. Yep. Like, like the magician said earlier, it, it's, it, it's getting balloonized. <laughs> so they get stretched a bit thin. Is he trying to do it like an Irish, yeah, that Irish dance or something? I forget how it's called. I'm sure that was Irish. Looked almost like he was trying to do the Polish one. He almost got hit there. Look, I, I forgot what that dance even is called, but probably, probably is. It's one of those that everyone keeps forgetting what it, it's called, so they always end up calling it Russian or Polish dance. Yeah, I'm, I'm drawing a full blank on what the hell it might be. Okay, give me those. And give me those. Well, I'm pretty sure Riverdons and that, Irish that Step might... thing is different. Yeah, probably, I was probably thinking of Riverdance. 
And yeah, as we walk and run along these, they actually make sound. Is it entire this or is an instrument? Yep. shown there if, if an enemy that's been hit hits another enemy they will also be hit that's a nice detail yeah you you can just cause you can just cause chain reactions with that and here's another nymph come on i don't think it's actually possible to catch up with them Oops. So yeah, we just need to chase them to the end of note. Oop, almost got hit. Okay, and there we go. And yeah, now we have the hover ability, which for the teen seas means a... Uh, oh. Doing this. The heck? Uh, with Globox, it's even sillier since he just flaps his wings. <laughs> wings, his arms but, like wings. It was just to ask, when did he get wings? Well, during uh, during most of Rayman 3, he was a chicken. Oh, come on! <laughs> okay. Like two, yeah, they're, they're up there. That's clear as day. I can have the captain who will help me in English. But that's a more dead giver than someone needs saving. Yeah. Okay, Space Invader Birds. Yeah, so what is with this music? Yeah, what the heck? This music sounds more like it fits in the Alps. Kinda. So just flip over and there we go. Second of the hidden cages. Uh. Yeah, I'm having that I'm having that happen again where I'm, I'm just smiling and my cheeks are starting to hurt a bit from it. Oh, that's good actually. Well, besides it hurts. But it's good uh, at you not, smiling. Not to, yeah, not to the painful amount, but still. Uh. Oh dear. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm pretty sure the the, pe the, yeah, the two players who got the most lums would get in the picture thing and the other two would just be hanging around it next to it. Aww. Uh, this remains a uh, cooperative game, of course, not competitive. Though you could probably get just as much fun from getting in each other's way uh, I was just playing the game normally. There. I just glad I'm not did not uh, decide to join you to play this as a second character, for I probably accidentally hold you back. Uh, it would still be fun, and actually, I think you can play this game multiplayer over the internet because uh, on the side I have the my Steam friends page open and it says uh, let's see yeah it has a banner showing invite anyone to play so yeah you could mul you could uh, play this over the internet apparently which I didn't know right. but and it, it, we are from 2012 so it would make sense but let's say yeah, they, they would really started to push for it yeah let's see 
Rats, new tricky treasure unlocked in Jibberish Jungle. That is the one level that we couldn't do. So, should we go give that a shot? Because that is how we get those skull teeth. Or should we continue in this world? Let's continue in this world. We can always go back for skull teeth later. Yeah. Best original score. Where they... <laughs> <laughs> were they plotting ahead with uh, what game award they were going for? Yeah, <laughs> maybe. Uh, this this game, like all of the Rayman games, has really good music. It, 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 in a way, it's a very it's very much like a Sonic in that. Yeah, even if the game is uh, below average for the series, it will still have good music. Yeah, and very wonderfully made. Oh, don't tempt me. I like, yeah, I can see that it, it, it is hard to t read it out loud while he's talking. Yeah. <laughs> really? Note birds? What the heck? <laughs> okay, they will actually go down over. Okay. Well, this is a bit more helpful. They're, they're not uh, angry birds, they're music birds. And. Okay, if they don't go all the way down, they just go back up again. Okay. I think you mean songbirds. <laughs> yeah, that works better. Also, uh, hello there. What Stay the heck? To my soul bird. <laughs> oh, oh, you were... <laughs> I thought it was an enemy, but no. It's a bounce path. Okay. Those from here. If I didn't fall down, oh well. Oh dear. There we go. Oh, there's a skull. There's a skull coin up there. So. Uh, what the? <laughs> actually make. They're actually making noise as well, it seems. Okay, uh, let's just backtrack a little tiny bit. And hope that that heart jar is still up here. Yep. There we go. Uh, me defeating my own points. Or getting in my own way. Oh, that's a big one. There we go. I'm not oh. sure what those are supposed to be, but I think they might be black lungs. There we go. No. This really just sounds like a polka bit. Or maybe I'm just on culture. In Polka the damn dons we've been trying to identify earlier, but I think that's the name. <laughs> Maybe it actually is. Uh, that's, yeah, polka is more of a genre than a single dance, I believe. It's a music genre. Oh, okay, maybe I... But this Polka dance, so... Oh, no, now I'm gonna show myself here. Okay. They're gonna... Uh, Far from a music and dance expert. Hey, okay, let's not miss the bloody birds. And there we go. Yes. Are the, are, what is with this teen, teensy's feet? They look like duck feet. Oh. <laughs> ah, and, um. There we go. 
<laughs> they just look so angry. Really angry. Oh, dick. Oh, another switch. Oh, okay. That was fixed to this oh, the discordant notes in the, the lines. Okay. Either something is hidden down there, or it's just a... It's a smug bait trap. There we go. There's some interesting bird statues in the background. Oh, hello. Creepy birds. Yeah, they are... Something back there. I keep grabbing them when I don't have enough momentum to really keep going. Oh, oh, heart, thank you. Do we? Uh, let's not risk it. Actually, let's risk it now. For the biscuit? <laughs> okay, I, I... I kicked him into the air. I didn't expect it to actually go that distance. That, that spider looks very concerned. Oh, no coin this time. <laughs> yeah, I, very snappy angry birds. I think that was more than just angry, that one. Uh, I saw a clip the other day. I think it was a, for meme reason of one of the angry bird movies. I think they had two movies, I think. Uh, I two, three, I must count. Bad. I, I'm still surprised they even made movies of them. It was sabotaging something, and, and then came an albatross whose abs made a shotgun reload sound. <laughs> okay. And then he smacked away the red bird after saying thanks after some ladybird just complimenting his abs. Uh, was a bit, what the heck, for me there, just seeing that out of nowhere. Yeah, that was... From what I've heard, they were pretty dumb still. Give me those two. Yeah, though, I haven't heard if people like them or not. Uh, at the very least, the first one made enough uh, to get a sequel. Yeah, uh, making but... enough money doesn't always mean being a good movie. Yeah. No. However, it's, it's one of the weird things, like, you haven't heard it was good, but you haven't heard it was bad either, just... nothing. Okay, <laughs> no clue what that bird was. Okay, let's just bust this open. There we go. What the heck were you doing there? Charging up the attack. Just, yeah, it, as you can see, the teensies don't actually physically attack, they use magic for it. Just, well, they're teensy. Okay. Literally, figuratively. Okay. Oop. I was going to say thank you, but then I missed it completely. Uh. Hey. And this is probably the last room here. Yep. There we go. What the? 
Okay, time to grab the recharge cable for my headphones. Okay. I think I misspoke earlier. There was two hidden chests and the end chest. <laughs> Not three hidden chests. They just move. <laughs> I keep misspeaking. Alright. Take no sit. Let's see what will be the next, <laughs> the next level then. Yeah, we're getting these quick, huh? So we're going to need 45 for that treasure you know, chase. We win or lose. Close the gears, getting that cable. Let's actually take a look here. We have okay. red box. There you go, back. Welcome back. And let's give this one a try for a bit. <laughs> okay. Yep. Win oh, yeah. or lose. <laughs> oh, come on. And oh, dear gods. The abomination. I did say. Oh, hello. There we go. Okay. The flying frog. Oh, what he's supposed to be. Oh, that's what you faced earlier. Yeah. Was that a canary with a bagpipe? I'm sure you would call it a bagpipe. It looked more like a trombone. A mix of trouble one by by I guess we have to see if we can find another one. Uh, we probably will. Uh, oh, I see a skull coin there. Okay, so we can just fall down these by not acting. Uh, but if we try to fly, we go up. Okay. Thank you. Okay, this entire area is hovering up. And, oh, yeah, secrets. Or hidden area more. Hello, hunters. They are back! Okay. What if we... <laughs> that if we do that. Uh... It's just fun dispatching those things, you know, the, the things, those guys, just because they're such jackasses. Yeah, no, is just me or they sort of reminds you of Dick Dastardly? <laughs> A bit. It's not good hit. Like, it's not just one on one copy, it's bloody damn similar. It's a trombone uh, yeah, bag yeah, it's a... <laughs> Okay. What the heck? Boing, boing, and... Boing, 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 boing. Okay, so that's how those are going to be... Yeah, that's how those are going to be an issue. Oh, dear. Oh. One fact! Sweden have bagpipes. Okay. Traditional bagpipes, just... Uh, they're not really something to brag about. Like, uh, using the Scottish and Irish uh, ba uh, bagpipes, right? How big they can get. Yeah. I was more like a handbag with four pipes. 
And by handbag, I mean like a lady's handbag. Okay. I only see pictures of them. I never see them used. I only, I was only, I was one day looking up with bagpipes out of curiosity and saw a picture of Swedish bagpipes. And it was small. Go, I didn't go. even know it until then. Uh, a bag hand pipes. Or hand bag pipes. Yeah, kinda. At least there are frequent checkpoints in these areas, or at least in most. There we go. And come on, damn it! But you got the loot. Uh, I think. Uh, no, apparently not. Yeah, well, let's just move on. And uh, straight into another hidden area. I look so concerned at times. Like, what is my existence? Or like, please don't jump on me, I don't want to kill you. Oops. Well, we luckily had the heart. <laughs> so they, they don't actually look like they have the heart to attack us. Yeah, I don't think they do. He just... Yeah. He just fart. <laughs> no. Or at least I hope not. You? Be careful now. Okay, I, I know Glowbox's bum looks plenty pokeable, but let's not. I say that and that. Oh dear, Helian. simple platforming just don't go up into the spikes okay not sure why that had needed two entrances okay like that Careful now. Okay, they won't. Yeah, that's one that's pretty easy to grab. But uh, the, something about force, like they can be beautiful in styles like these, but it can also, but it's more like they will look beautiful, but also a bit terrifying. Yep. Change the song a bit, but that's more to do with the the length of it, it seems. Or I might just be pulling. I might just be saying. Shit. Oh, damn it! Maybe you're not uh, haven't noticed due to you so focus on not dying. Yeah, and even failing at that. Case in point. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear gods! Okay. So once we're done harassing the local canary population. Come on, Glowbox. Actually, 
I think we might have to actually hit the actual locks in it and not just the cage itself. Huh. Oh dear <laughs> god, that smile. Uh, smug bastard. Hey, is it more smug than cowardly now? I'm sure if I like probably, that. He probably figured out that he will respawn anyways. Uh. Make the glade uh. of dreams. Okay, we still have a good amount of time back now left. Yep, new character. But we've already seen them there. It's Globox's biggest teensy fan. Skyward Sonata. Okay. All right. And I'm, I'm pretty sure we'll have enough, enough electunes at the end of each world if we yeah, if we don't skip each and every one of them except for the end level ones. Okay. Oh, this one. What the heck is... That kind of um, looks disturbing. Oh, oh still got it. Um, there we go. No idea why I attacked there. There we go. We just need to hit it. Anything? No, we can't reach. Uh, oh, oh, hello. I heard that at the last second, that, but we can't actually go back. There, there was any. There was a hidden air area just above the door. Oh. So that was the sound. Oh, what was the door screaming in pain? Coin. Let's leave that coin behind. That. We don't want this thing to outrun us too much, even if it is going slow. Let's not get crushed, because we know that won't be saved by the art. <laughs> yeah, almost again had a patient point moment there, huh? Yeah, be careful now. Uh, what the? There's just something primordially funny about just knocking an enemy into the sky and having them fall back down, huh? Primordially funny. Th that's a word? A sentence? <laughs> okay, don't get too excited, Glowbox. I said, don't get too excited, Glowbox. <laughs> go. Let's, let's test this. One lock. And we can't damage the You <laughs> can! <laughs> uh. Uh, live and learn. Yep. Live and learn English indeed. Uh, okay. Oh, just in time. There we go. What even would that thing be called? A living didgeridoo beast or something? So what time is it? Uh, all right, just gonna go through some food you need to the machine. So I'll be right back, says I can't not bring the headphones with me this time. Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll just need to manage to survive without you. <laughs> it's a, oh yeah, the don't die. Stupidities. Yep. And here he is yet again. 
Not matching that one to the gear. Spring, spring. Go. Yeah, much better. <laughs> it's completely launching them. They probably don't weigh much because they're bloody bird, but still. Sure, it's not lag behind. Ooh. <laughs> well, the invincibility frames were of no use there. And pressing neither there. Uh, don't miss it. Okay. Uh, uh, Fifth times the charm. Okay, I'm starting to get the, the feel for it again with just keyboards. But still, I really want to be using a controller for this. Sounds so freaking happy. There you go. Back for now. Welcome back. Thank you. And there we go. Another level done. I just should probably not have a blanket around my legs. Okay. Uh, I have it just to not, uh, not to be cozy, just be cozy, but that thing is making me feel a bit too cozy. If you get my drift. Okay, don't go falling asleep now. Snore. Snore. Okay, I, I wouldn't make proper snoring sound. Probably is, yeah. My mic doesn't identify snoring sound when I say snore. Okay. I was not. Yeah. A, I think I remember. I have. A, there's a band I like. It's, what was it called? Eternal Sonata. Eternal Sonata. It's an old band by now. Uh, there's a singer named um, Sinatra, but I'm at Frank Sinatra, was it? Oh yeah, that, that's that guy too. No idea if I heard their music. Yeah, this is not going to have new lines for this, huh? Okay, no turning back. We haven't seen much story talk at the moment. Yeah, it, it, there isn't too much story. It, 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 there, there will be some stuff that will... Come on, glow box. There will be some things that will, you'll see later. But for now, at least, it will... What happened there? I can tell you what. I know what happened. You messed up. <laughs> I think... I don't know what happened. It, it, looked, it seemed like Glowbox stopped responding or something. Or maybe it got stuck in between those vines. Or the maybe? The vines. Oh well. 
Moving on. That, okay, that was okay. almost my mess up there. Okay, th those ones are almost a little bit Eldritch Horror, like they, they have thorns and eyeballs. Really, I've managed to get hit again. No, you don't. Beaten up of your blattering. Okay. There we go. I really but... get annoyed by that smug smile. Uh, it, it's like he's doing a Earthworm Jim smile or something. Like there's over exaggerated ones. Yeah. Okay. I think the next level is going to be another mosquito shoot 'em up, or mosquito em up, or whatever you would call them. Oh dear. But uh, let's actually go swap to. Uh, yeah. Let Let's just go with uh, one of the normal teen C's instead, like this one. And who is he? Uh, I think, I think in the manual, each of these, uh, both of these teensies get explanations, maybe. Uh, I, I know that in Rayman Legends, all of the characters do get a bit of a descriptive line as well. But, yeah, we'll, we'll just have to guess for now. Uh, it looks like the one you used earlier. Shooting me softly. That's a reference to the song, uh, I, I don't know if it's the title of the song, but it is one of the lines, Killing Me Softly. I always forgotten that. I, yeah, I forgot about the, that song. I can't... I, I remember the, ti the title, but nothing about the lyrics. There we go. From the lens of the reviews, where are we going now? Like I said, I think I prefer the lump singer than the mosquito. There we go. We've lost our extra hearts. How did I not get hit there? Good okay. question! There we go. We can get we can turn those off by shooting them enough times at least. Almost. Phones ringing. Was this Actually, a number? Don't... I don't know. I actually don't know what the missions or what the levels are in order. And uh, hello. What the? Well, I think we can guess one gimmick of the next world. So why the hell? Why the hell do they smile when shot? I guess it could be more of an, a shocked expression than a smile, but still. Yeah, that does look concerning. Uh, also, I'm guessing that's supposed to be glow box <laughs> in the murals. Oop. Oh, there. Uh, maybe? The music is taking a lot more of a Spanish or Mexican uh, tune. Yeah. Hmm. Bit of an Aztec world then? Maybe. Sometimes it's a bit hard to know what they are do what they try to aim for when sometimes they mix it so many up that it makes it impossible. To know if there's a specific theme. And that's the heart gone. 
Oh. The ice walls. And Mountain Dew. There's something big frozen. But are those? I guess they are blood oranges. Spike? Blood CPS. <laughs> yeah, what the heck? It's not getting crushed. So I guess what the Oh, so what I'm seeing in background is a frozen fruit. Yep. It's not just an ice world, it's a fridge world. It's also a watermelon and... Oh, there's, we have, well, there's another watermelon and with a straw. Yeah, we are seeing this one. That is... The only team we not tried yet is... The crazy one. And the one in the green robes. <laughs> it, that's, it, that's what I'm talking about. Uh, uh, there's there's also the, the glow box fan that <laughs> uh, but yeah let's go back to rain man after this yeah, it is called Rayman origins after all and suppose hmm. Yeah, another tricky treasure unlocked. Uh, let's uh, let's actually go after those two now. Probably a good idea. Okay, snoring tree. You could have just pressed S to get there. But yeah, this is the other one who, who I'd say would looks a bit concerning. Yeah. But there we go. And yeah, 10 more Electoons for the female Teensy. Or the Princess. Queen or Princess Teensy. Okay. Anyway. Let's go Princess here and get one. one of these tricky treasures of Prime. Okay, just the same voice lines, it seems. Not, not the same voice line, but the same text, just a different voice doing them. <clears throat> yeah, the thing with these levels is... Uh, these things. <laughs> okay. That okay, that's, that's interesting, yeah. There's many games where you just punch open and destroy chest still, so I guess he... They don't want anything to do with that. Never mind, you do it, you just destroy yourself. Oh dear. Uh, yeah, we have to... I don't remember if you need to catch up or just <laughs> finish the level. But yeah, you will need to hurry along because... Yeah, things start crumbling down. Okay, don't ground pound that one. Yeah, like not a good idea. And uh, yeah, th these missions get a bit of a sequel in the next game, which I'll say I, pref I much prefer. The music. Okay. Levels. Okay, come here, you. And corners. <laughs> Wait, what I just had concerned face. <laughs> yeah, what what what's this going on? <laughs> uh, I guess it feels bloody cold or something. Cold uh, as death. 
Okay, that's one of those gone. So now we go back to the snoring tree. We give him one of the teeth, but as you can see, he needs a bunch more. Oh, those are his own teeth. Now they're not his exactly, but they do. He does want them. Okay, shall we give this one a, uh, this one's treasure run a try as well, or shall we move on to the next world? Uh, let's, let's do it. Let's uh, take this one as well, so we know we have taken it. Yeah. Yeah, c c c the cacophonic chase. Okay, and I think my food stuns so are gonna grab it. Okay. So don't die. Second verse, same as the first. <laughs> God damn it, too slow. Okay, here we go. Okay, break. Okay, that climbing is what does me in there. Hmm. Try to jump. Yep, a little bit later. There we go. Keep on going, just keep <laughs> pressed. Don't try to fly because they will probably get me stung. Go. The thing is really just zooming. Oh, don't. God. Too late. If you're, if you need to climb onto something, you're probably too late. Like that. Okay. Okay, it can be a bit finicky with how precise it wants you to drop jump. Jump. Okay, I'm, I'm just going to try and wait for the very last second that you can jump in these. Okay. Uh, hmm. I'm not sure what, how, what I mess up there. Do I need to hold the jump button longer on the wall jumps or something? need to start flying, you're going too slow. I hope these don't take too many attempts. And back. And back. And this time I threw the blanket back to the bed. I already feel more awake. I think I'm serious with the cold and the winter blanket somehow gave a little bit too much comfort. What exactly? I don't. I don't see how much. I, uh, if, what I can improve on that bit there. Hmm. Yeah, a running attack can get you some more speed, but. I think in general uh, we might be late. The note we're catching up. Okay. Okay. Yep. There we go. And nope. Yep. There we go. I almost messed it up by trying to go for an attack. Okay. Yeah, uh, I, you, know, you know what he reminds me of when he does that? Uh, who? Like, either Daffy Kadak or... 
Bloody, what's the bonus name again? Bugs Bunny, you forgot Bugs oh, Bunny's what? name? Thank you, I temporarily forgot his name. Uh. Yeah, it, it kind of looked like though, uh, them, when they realized they're holding a rocket or something. Actually, yeah, it's very much a Daffy Duck expression. Uh, oh God. And talking of the duck whose goose gets frequently cooked, let's go to Gourmandland. Polar Pursuits. Hmm. A food level while I'm eating. All right. What the... Okay. What the heck are those? From. Just... Okay. Promoter thought, you no, know, we can't swim underwater. Yep, maybe. Okay. Wait. Are you swimming, Kool Aid? Probably. So I don't know what the hell happened there. Yeah, is it cool or some sort of soda for? I just realized the water is very fizzy. What the heck? Um, uh, oh, there you go. Yeah, I, I pressed the replay save button there because I want to see what the hell just happened. I think it, I think Rayman got launched around or something. There, 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 there. Un, dos, tres, oh, cuatro. come on! Yeah, I feel like they really took a lot of inspiration from cartoons with this one. Okay, here. Okay, indeed. It seems like for them this is a tropical paradise. Even though it's, um... Oh. <laughs> no, look when the umbrella closes. Huh? Okay. Come on. <laughs> it squishes itself. Oh, that, that's uh. a classic. I, I just realized. Uh. What the heck? But I was saying, I just noticed something about the buildings in the background. Yep, they have frozen think, umbrellas. Yeah, I think they use your frozen umbrellas as roofs. That, wait, is that that frozen... No, wait, that's that strawberry. Yep. I wasn't sure first if that, if that was what meat or something. Okay, here we go. Um, what? Uh, yeah, let's not deal with those. Oh, it's watermelon juice. With uh, the things swimming around in them, you might get an idea of that being something else. Bloody heck! And apparently those are forks that are arguing. Uh, Okay. Oh, no. oh, they're not plants. They're those little decorative uh, things you can also get in drinks. Oh, hello. Oh, All right, let's save her for that. Sounds unpleasant. Yeah, no, let's get real honest. I don't think anyone enjoys being rolled over. Nope. Especially not when it's. Like her case. That's probably worst. Wait, I'm not sure what that in the background is. Did that thing? Yeah, it did shrink. What the heck? Cheerful yeah, music is the wrong time for it. Now you're down looms. 
There we go. Is this a dino fairy? Oh, Nim? Yay! Wait, what? what? Uh oh. Yep. <laughs> now we've got to deal with these guys in miniature version. Oh no. Okay. Nope. Wrong way, Rayman. There we go. And that's... The first? Okay, I thought it would be the second. There we go. Okay. And moving on. Uh, oh no, Christmas decoration. Si oh wait, it was just a bag. Yep. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, uh, actually, I was just still today, I noticed something. No. They are selling both Halloween and Christmas things at the same time now. Step one. Uh, yeah, they, they, they just keep uh, putting up the, the Christmas stuff earlier and earlier, and it's getting really freaking annoying. Yeah, I, I understand you brought, brought forth the Christmas stuff directly after. Halloween and such, but not at the same time. Like, if there's something that makes me a bit sad is, it seems that the pandemic has really harmed anything that's Halloween related, like horror movies and such. I'm not sure about that myself, but it wouldn't be too surprising. As in... Usually, I will see a lot of trailers and such, and a lot more horror games. But there doesn't seem to be been many horror games about. Or horror movies. However, I already some month ago saw a trailer for a Christmas movie. Okay. In September. Oh, okay, yep. It's a straw. Holy crap. But yeah, that... I enjoy Christmas and such, but bloody heck, I do enjoy Halloween as well, like Spooktober and all. Hmm. I think, I think we might have talked about this before, or, or I might have talked about this before, but uh, Halloween isn't really something that is, uh, well, as celebrated over here. Like there are some families who do go around uh, with the kids. Uh, for candy and such, but in general, it's more of a yeah small uh, small time thing. Yeah, same here. Do we, it, officially, it's uh, a Christian holiday. Sounds yeah, they have a more Christian version of it. But most people celebrate the Halloween version of it way more. There's not many as people enjoy that way more than the Christianized version. Hey man, why were you... Uh, who's pressing left there? Why did you go right? Uh, but also, let's be honest, it's hard to keep that spirit alive during the pandemic. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, uh, something else for a moment. You, you, you notice, you remember this uh, counter that I have right next to me here? The counter? Yeah, the, the number. Yeah? Uh, the thing with that is, I, it is supposed to show how many people are viewing, and I, when I look at uh, the other chat program, when, the, when I look at the chat program that I have open on the site, there's a bunch of names there, but clearly not as many as here, so I get the feeling we've been found by a bunch of bots again. Oh dear. So yeah, going to need to clean those out. Dashing through the snow. We were we were just talking about Christmas stuff, and dashing through the snow is what? 
I forget specifically which Christmas song, but it is. Let's see, dancing uh. through the snow on a one man sleigh. Mm -hmm. Santa oh, Santa Claus is coming to town. Yeah, that's the one. It. Uh, I gotta say this. There's one thing I, I accidentally pro learned to enjoy due to I got tired of Christmas songs. I actually enjoy the parodies way more. And not just any parodies. Yeah. The Lovecraftian ones. <laughs> the Dello. And yes, there are several of them, like, there are entire albums of uh, Lovecraftian and Cthulhu carols. They're dog and uh, grim, but in a more hilarious way. Uh, I think I know a song to, s to send you, Dan. It, Is it Fishman? No. Oh, there we go. Okay, now I'm curious. I'll show it after the stream, since we have uh, about 8 minutes left. Yeah, oh, I should people forget. We will also stream Minecraft later, people. Probably, uh, if nothing uh, comes in the way. Yeah, and... We were... I forgot, were we to stream tomorrow as well or not? Uh, we can get one stream in tomorrow. Uh, yeah. Actually, no, no, no. Uh... uh Maybe not Minecraft, but we could do Shantae, because we usually do Shantae before the side stuff. Or the yeah, week. true. The yeah, way we I'm, typically I'm... do it is two main week, you know, then one side, you know, then again, actually, uh, <laughs> we'd already done two uh, main week streams, and this is the third, so technically this should be Shantae then, but oh well. Yeah. A I, bit I, of a I'm... change. Yeah, I, I'm a Prashanti or Minecraft, boo for fun. Go. Wait. And anglerfish. Okay. I don't know. Oh, that's the deal with these things. If you stand on the bubbles, they go down. If you don't stand on them, they go up. That might prove a bit tricky, especially with how, well, floaty Tiny Rayman is. There we go. This works. I say that and immediately... Okay, third time the charm. Come on. Not go for the lumps this time. Oh, oh up, dear. Up. Up. I kind of wonder, does all the memes have names? I think most of them have names, but though I don't know where to find them. Is it, I kind of find it annoying that the only unit get to know the names is through the manual, even though they have, have dialogue in the game. You and there's a hidden thing. Go. Ah, oh, right. Yeah. It, Tiny Rayman is too small to actually hurt those and to bother the uh, bugs holding the umbrellas. Okay, we missed one. Continuing on. That's it. Yes, yeah, so if we are lucky, we're not only able to finish Nolf, but we may also be able to finish Shanti perhaps today. Yeah. Uh, again, that's a perhaps. Uh, let's see. We need we need to find a bunch of stuff in there. Uh, in there to so get the, the record. The requirements for the true ending, but there shouldn't be too many left. 
Like, we already had... We already finished Techno Baron's request. Yeah, we the, the, uh, to... hmm. I've been basically halfway through with that. Yeah. No, more a quarter, but... Uh, still, we ha it shouldn't be too hard to find the rest. And at least the map, the levels show where you can find that stuff in the first place. Luckily enough. You can find it in there. Um, let's see, we have... I think we can do one more level, because I started the timer late. Piping Hot. Alright, here we go. Go and through. Oop. And uh, yeah, now we're going into the lower area of this place. Which has a very different choice of I ingredients, huh? Dear. Are you Mexican That's music? Oh yeah, uh, I see even some Aztec-like or Mexican-like artwork. And uh, Mexican-style pottery. And... Piatas. In yeah. What the heck? Uh. Okay, I'm, I'm going to go grill some mushrooms after this. No, you don't. Yep. We can actually stand on them when we're tiny. Okay. Uh. What, what are those supposed to be? Uh, let's get our hand back. Boing, boing, boing. Wait, and that could look like the damn flush thing the Odin Beams has as a hat. Okay. Uh, I, got, I gotta say, when it comes to foods, I, <laughs> I very much prefer uh, warm dishes over cold dishes. Well, most dishes I eat are usually warm when it comes to uh, a proper meal and such. Let me see. The... Hmm. The only thing I eat that's very cold would be ice cream for, well, obvious reason. Yeah. And anyway, a cold drink is not food, but it's still usually... You... Some days you're in warm, some days you're in your cold. Okay, what? Oh, <laughs> it's it's maize. Oh, corn. Corn is what it is. Oh dear. What the heck is it? Um. <laughs> it's a tube of hot sauce. Uh, dear. Yeah, um, I remember I saw they started selling something new on the tube cheese department. No. Sriracha cheese in these kind of tubes. Okay. I've not tried them yet, due to I'm unsure if I would want to have to try. I should check up on my stock of Swatch. I think I'm out. Yeah, okay. here we go again. I should get ready to buy more next week since... Now when I'm finally able to do egg omelettes again and egg scrambled eggs, I'm finally using more Sriracha. Okay. Spiky Swiss cheese? 
whatever that's supposed to be. What the heck? Why is this? Why is the cheese spiky? Yeah, I'm concerned. Also, those things at the entrances, I'm pretty sure those are, that's supposed to be pickles. Now here it's spice. Or, actually, no, it's, it's more like... Oh yeah, it is, it is pickle. Okay. Are you sure or not? I'm not sure, that might be pickle or... Uh-oh. I think that might be a jalapeno. Pepper could work as well, yeah. See, <laughs> especially considering the environment. I said jalapeno. Oh wait, it's jalapeno pepper. Or wait, did I get that right? Jalapeno pepper? I think you did. All right, for a for, oh, hell, for a moment, a split moment, I thought you misheard me. No, oh so wait, jalapeno is a pepper. For a moment, I thought it was its own, its own thing. Oh, <laughs> that works. Okay. And that's this level done. I think some of them fell into the hot sauce. <laughs> okay, let's just... Okay, we got only a... Relatively few amounts of llamas this time, but oh well. Uh, yeah. That's already two, well, two and a half levels about done. And the, oh, we know who that is. So let's there she is, and there look at her hat. Oh, uh. we spawned close enough for that. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, let's quickly check out the new character, and then we'll check out uh, the Dino Nymph. There we go. What the heck? Okay. Yeah, yeah that's, see that's right? a Dino <laughs> thing she's wearing. Uh, oh dear. Uh, uh, as I said, it's oh, Rayman is the only game that tried to aim for kids that would allow ha to have nymphs. Since let's be, let's be honest, nymphs are not usually the creature you would think for a child-friendly game. Uh, yeah. <laughs> but with that, we'll have to end this stream. Um, I don't know how many streams we might end up with this. I it's. The rate we've gone so far, we it might be the shortest Rayman game yet. Because I think... Mm, I don't think we'll be able to finish it in another stream. Maybe a, a third. Yeah, for, usually around three or four. True. But for now, let's head over here. There we go. And, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm going to be looking at changing up uh, these the backgrounds a bit again. Uh, with some new generated arts, uh, I still have to commission someone, but it's, I'm, I just have to, I'm just at that point where I don't really know who to approach, and the people I do know who do arts, I'm <laughs> unsure if I want to approach them, and uh, it, I don't know how to exactly name it, but I just really don't like being the first to approach uh, on stuff like that, especially with people I somewhat know. Because, yeah, just bringing money into things sometimes just completely messes uh, with uh, relationships. Yeah, it, I, if it's awkward. Yeah, I, I've had it once before where I was lending money to someone because they were in trouble and such. Uh, but, yeah, they just... Uh, <clears throat> it's, it's not like they backstabbed me or something. But it just became too difficult for them to pay me back, and it it was a quite it was quite a sum of money that uh, I had lent them. Uh, but yeah, then just family problems started, um, and yeah, you can see you can guess the uh, the snowballing effect from there. Yeah, it escalated. And I guess this was not their their fault. They just 
it's going to be way too too much for them to be able to pay back. Yeah, and it, it wasn't the first time that they you know, borrowed from me and uh, had trouble uh, paying back. Uh, I, I, for anyone perhaps to mention, no, it, it wasn't that I was getting scammed. I knew them reasonably well. I know people who knew them pretty well and know enough to that they weren't scamming or anything. But uh, yeah, we just agreed to... I, I just agreed to forgive the loan and uh, yeah, for it to ne that we they would never ask me for money again. Yeah. Okay. Probably for the best. Okay. Move changing the screen share to the browser. And let's take a look at people who are streaming. We have Doggett Douglas McDog, who is streaming Tomb Raider Gold, apparently. He, I believe he was streaming Tomb Raider 2 before. So I guess that he switched up. Uh, hmm. We have Kikoskia, who is streaming Animal Crossing New Horizons. Um, let's see. Mage Master 22, who is streaming Dragon Quest 11. Okay, I didn't know they'd gone that far with the count yet. How many? Uh, you know the name. He, uh, they're Bobby. streaming MechWarrior Online. And then we have Frain. I believe we've uh, we've seen them pop up here before, but I don't know. I think we raided them last. Uh, probably. I th I remember seeing something. They're, they're streaming a Plague Tale Requiem, which is actually the sequel to the first A Plague Tale game, which I thought they were streaming before. Then we right. have K-A-I-N-E-I, K -A -I -N -E -I, who is streaming... Is that Vermin... Yeah, Warhammer Vermintide 2. Then we have some art streamers, or art streams. Profound, <laughs> Profound Badness is streaming Sweet Home. And let's see, that's about the game. That's about the small to medium sized. Well, I wouldn't call Kikoski a small streamer. They, they are, they, they've been around YouTube for a hell of a lot of time, a long time. I think approaching or past 15 years now. Uh, so yeah, they're definitely not a small streamer or a small content creator. Yeah, definitely worth a, a watch for anyone interested in old games, because that is what he mostly does. Old, even older than what we've been doing, actually. Impressive. So, yeah. Any of those sound of interest, or shall I pick? Oh. I guess... Either Resident Evil or Warhammer Vermintide. Uh, I'm leaning towards Vermintide. Uh, <laughs> yeah, Drakir read off one of these that I didn't read off. Uh, Super Sahama, who is streaming Resident Evil Revelations 2. Wait, I, I didn't know that game got a sequel. I, I might take a, I might take a Google to see what, what it's that about. But for now, as usual, we will mute the site. Then we'll go to the one we'll be raiding. Copy the name. So I don't can make so I don't come across as even bigger of a fool by mistyping it and slash raid paste. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> okay. Later on, later today, in about three and a half hours. Uh, yeah, Shantae. I, I, if I said Minecraft at any point, I misspoke because well, I, I, I was the one saying Minecraft. Yeah, I, I might have talked about that earlier at some point, but oh, I do, it doesn't matter. Minecraft tomorrow then. But uh, yeah, until next time, thank you everyone who has been watching now or later, and thank you as always, Dirk here. You're welcome as always, my friend. So let's get this raid started. And uh, yeah, again, thanks for watching, and until next time, have a nice day, and until then. Be safe, everyone! Stream deck.